The Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, on Monday refused to recognize a battle chairman of the Labour Party, Julius Abure, at his quarterly meeting in Abuja. Abure, who had attended the preparatory meeting for the Edo and Ondo governorship elections with other party chiefs, had to be excused from the event. AIT News learns that the action was taken on grounds that he was not invited. <laughs> Political party chiefs are meeting to receive updates from IME on the state of preparedness for the Edo and Edo governorship elections billed for September and November this year. The meeting did not come without some trouble. IME chairman, Professor Mahmoud Yaku, extends his concentrations with his guests and expresses initial surprise on citing Edo Zenjoko, the man who replaced Barista Sly Ezo Kenya as national chairman of All Progressive Grand Alliance, APTA, following a recent court order. <laughs> but it is the Labour Party national chairman, Julius Abui, that suffers a legitimacy crisis. After these initial exchanges, he was asked to leave the meeting as he was not invited, a development presumed to have been connected to the Mewi National Convention, where he was purportedly elected as the national chairman. Abui when contacted, said, I never attended the meeting. I only was at INIC for a different reason, but not for the meeting. End of quote. On the Edo and Undo polls, as well as issues on local government elections and polls in Nigeria, INIC chairman said the commission is ready, noting that the final list of registered voters is soon be published. Campaign by political parties and candidates is in full swing in both Edo and Undo states. This is the time for party leaders to demonstrate compliance with the Commission's regulations and guidelines for political parties 2022, especially the aspect dealing with rallies, processions and campaigns already available on our website. The chairman of the Intra-Party Advisory Council, IPAC, appealed to INEC to take over the conduct of local government elections across states in the country. The commission had the capacity to conduct all local government elections as it did for FCT area council, generally adjust to be free, fair and without rancor. So IPAC supports this and all the National Assembly to amend the relevant electoral laws to accommodate this. For that to happen, Professor Yakubu says there has to be an amendment to the 1999 Constitution to empower INEC to conduct local government polls. Ijoma Osama, AIT News, Abuja.